Holy crap, she's dead? Dude. Dude, this is trippy. It's not her blood. Here, let me help you. I will be fine, thank you. Andrew, where is he? He has taken Eddie. I, I tried to stop him, but he struck me. Me. There was a madness in his eyes. I do not understand what is happening. First Eddie, and now Andrew. It's probably your wacky ass husband, babe. Open your eyes. See your husband for what he really was. A pawn of evil. An evil that infected and corrupted every life around him. How dare you speak about my Edward like that? Or about the family he protected all his life? He was a man like no other. That he was, though not in the way you think. Holy crap. Let's not insult her, baby. I will not hear another word <laughs> from you about my husband. We don't have time for this. Look in the desk in the old wing if you will not believe us. Run along. Yep. She looks uh, like she has a shock she color. She might know more. We need to talk to her again. Without attacking her. Oh, of course. You're right. <laughs> He said, yeah, babe, I figured. <laughs> he said, yep, you're always right. What a, what a girl. What a, what a lady. Um, is there more in the diary? Oh, there is. Alright, you ready for my, my troubled pronunciations? Andrew had me fooled. Had everyone fooled. The child of an unholy union between father- <gasps> I was right?! If you guys remember in the last episode, I said something about how he slept with his daughter. That's gross. Given up secretly for adoption. This burden was carried by Rory. The old man had killed his family in a fit of rage, and Edward and Margaret covered it up, used their knowledge to control him. Whatever he did and whatever dark force drove him to it, I owe Rory my life. Rory stood by us. How crazy the family is, so... He's part of the gang of misfits. I see now that my father was trying to protect me and warn me from beyond the veil. Andrew wants to bring Edward back from the dead, but what if something other than Edward comes back? My father seems to have found a way to avoid the grasp of the mirror, at least for now, but Edward, he has given to its cold embrace most willingly, it seems. I am not a believer in fate or destiny. All I know is that with Hannah at my side. I must stop Andrew before any more lives are lost to the black mirror. Sorry, you guys are like hearing my phone buzz, I'm sure. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. I don't. See you on the other side. Like that's Andrew's weird. mind seems to be crumbling under the mirror's influence. We need to stop him before he drags Edward's corrupted soul back into this world. I still cannot quite believe what is happening in this strangest of places. So, Andrew's basically a product of incest, which- There's something back there. Looks like a door. A door? Where to? Well, that's what we need to find out. Andrew clearly wants us to follow him. Mainly you, I reckon. Yeah, but you're coming too, babe. I cannot do that by myself. I might cry. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Well, we have no information to go on for that. Um. All right, so yeah, also we're still following the guide. <laughs> so after the last episode ended after like Rory had passed, the the broadcast stopped and there was an error. There was a problem 
with the uh, the game. So it like closed out. So I come back in, and the game proceeds to play about like three fourths before we like three fourths into the last segment. So I had to replay that part just really quickly, and then it moved on to the next cutscene, and we were like, we're not prepared. This isn't him. No. My Edward couldn't have written this. But yet, but yet he did, babe. My girl. Use your, use your brain, thank you. This is one of the symbols in the fireplace. But where to find the other? This is one of the symbols in the fireplace. No, no. So, uh, symbol in the fireplace. What's this? What is this? It's marked somewhere around Australia or Tasmania. What does the mark mean, do you think? I'm not sure. But I think I've seen a similar globe in the master study. Hmm. A similar globe in the master study. Let's talk to Granny over here. Being shocked. Culture shocked, I'm sure. How do you feel about your darling husband now? Babe. David, that's not helping. That's not the time. Why Edward wouldn't... He couldn't have written this. It must have been Andrew. Or, or young Eddie. Yes, yes, that's who it was. Not Edward. Not my Edward. Is she a product of Stockholm Syndrome? Because that's what it's starting to sound like. Do you know how Andrew got through the passage in the fireplace? No, I don't know. I thought I heard him sneaking about the Great Hall before he came into Eddie's room. But I cannot be sure. I know this is difficult to hear, but there is a madness cursing through the Gordon bloodline, and you know it. You've seen it tear our family apart. Andrew is the outcome of this madness, the result of what your husband did to Cecilia. No. <gasps> he would have never touched her. She doesn't know? Never. Would you like to sit down, Lady Margaret? No, no. I'm all right. It's just, he was always good to me. He did love me, in his way. That, that doesn't really convince me, but... Listen to me, Lady Margaret, this is important. Rory said there is something unresolved between my father and I. Do you know what he meant? I didn't know your father as well as I would have liked. I'm sorry, I... This is not the time for secrets, Lady Margaret. Just look at what this has brought us. I'm sorry. All that is happening... It makes no sense. All I can tell you is that your father was obsessed with the model of the castle in the Master's study. I have avoided that room for years. Okay. We need to get moving. Andrew could be doing anything to Eddie right now. Young Eddie doesn't deserve this. You need to save him. We'll try. You have our word. Is there anything you know about your husband? Something that could help us save Eddie's life? I don't know what it is, but I do know that Edward considered it valuable. Okay. What is it? <laughs> doesn't doesn't show you. You just have to guess, I guess. Also, we need to go to the master study for the globe, but also for the castle there. I think the castle will help. Oh no! Who is that? Rose, how did you? Fine. How she's still alive? Yeah. But I did continue. what had to be done. For our family. What else could I have done? <laughs> oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my. The old granny came and whooped her butt. Oh my gosh. This game <laughs> is gonna give me a. <laughs> she came in and punched her in the face. And she's like, what, a hundred years old? 90 something most likely 100 yikes ooh is this the globe we're looking for oh locked ok 
Okay. Oh, locked. Well, how do we unlock that? Ah. I. Ooh, we had a master key part. That's hot. Alright, let's go down. So I'm guessing these rooms will help us open up the thing too. Three, four, four. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm trying to look at everything. I want to go to the master study and try to do that castle since we have all the parts now. And I'm not too concerned. We should have known Andrew was like trouble from the moment he lied to us about the the, the freaking phone. And the time he was gone. And his car was there because apparently that was Andrew's car. Or something. Which meant he never left. Because they were talking about in the last, uh, one of the last episodes about how... <clears throat> Andrew actually went to town on foot, but that didn't make any sense to me, so. Let's try to open up the castle right now. Now that we have the key. All right, so we need the circle part up top, the cross part on the right. Okay, let's just get the key out. There's just so many things happening. I wish it was at the top, but I digress. Okay. Let me put my phone down. There's just so much happening right now. All right. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right let's move that one up. Mm hmm. All right, so uh, that one's gonna be like that. Be like that. The, that one's right. I still can't get over the fact that he slept with his own daughter. That's quite gross. That's actually kind of disgusting me just to think about it. Two, three. Okay, let's try that. There we go. Stop your whining. <gasps> you are seeing something again, aren't you? Yes. Give it back. Give it back. Okay. Yeah, 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 killed her. It's your fault. <gasps> so that's why he buried it in Cecilia's grave. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. A hidden switch. He's in the grip of the mirror. Oh. Oh. Okay. What did you see, David? My father. Uh, and Edward, he... It's all right. Take your time. Okay, so John killed his father, I'm guessing. Margaret covered up the fact that Edward didn't die by accident. He was murdered. Murdered? By whom? Rightfully so. My father. I mean, no one Your should father. kill, but... Are you sure? He would have only been a child then. I am sure. Then yes, he was. Lady Margaret sent him to boarding school soon afterwards. She was scared of him. And I suppose that's why she was afraid of me too. All oh, this fine. time. Trying to prove my father wasn't mad. That every man in the Gordon family isn't destined to become a murderer. But that's exactly what he was. He was only a child. Maybe the mirror drove him to it. It did. I saw, I, I saw the darkness take hold of him. Uh, but does it matter, though? Like Rory said, 
it doesn't wash away the guilt. Sooner or later I will be shedding innocent blood too. I shouldn't follow Andrew down there. I could end up a monster like every Gordon before me. And you should go. Just get yourself away from all this. Nonsense. You're the only one who can stop Andrew. You're armed with the knowledge your father never had. And remember, he did everything in his power to protect you. He sacrificed himself. He saw the horrors on the other side, and still did it. Now that you know the things that happened to him when he was a child. <sighs> you are right. He wasn't the father I needed in life. But in death, he gave everything for a mere chance to protect me. Huh. So, it's weirdly a very loving slash scary story. Like, he sacrificed himself for you. You do what you, you must. Thank you for everything. Now let us stop this madness once and for all. Ooh. Can we flick that switch, though? We got a trophy. Let's go. Clickety clickety. Margaret covered it up. She even lied about Edward's death. She told everyone it was an unfortunate accident. What is that? Is that a rose? Alright, whatever. Wait, well, let me. So we unlocked that. Okay. So we got that, and now. All right, let's get let's go to that globe. I'm feeling more confident with the guide next to me this time. I know it's lame to use guides in certain games, but like since it's a gameplay and we're trying to get through it quicker or not through it quicker, but in a timely manner so editing doesn't take as long, I think this is the best way to approach it. Like I said in the last episodes, one of them. Let's go this way. I think this is the way we came. This man is bonkers. Literally the craziest dude. Alright. Alright, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Let's do the key. Let's figure out the key. Alright, let's have a look. See. I don't like how the key is like, what? Five, seven spaces down. Okay. So the next one, that's good. What about this one? And then... This one... Alright, I think that's... And uh, again, we're looking at GamePressure.com guide. Yes, perfect. To figure it out, just because I don't want to... Ooh. Is this... I don't know. No, I don't want to do that. <sighs> Crap. So we it said something about Australia. Okay. 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 That's there it. we go. Look. Sorry, my like hairs on my neck. A stone plate full of ancient symbols. Oh. Is this the code? So. F P. Okay. Let's use that. Let's go try to get into this little room place. So grandma's dead. Great grandma's dead. Agnes is dead. The butler. Um, Elsa is dead. Um, Rory is dead now. Okay. Okay. So, for what I'm getting at, that didn't work. That didn't work. 
Okay, hold on. Okay. There we go. Again, use gamepressure.com as a guide. I just hope we are not too late. I hope we're too late. I'm scared. I I don't particularly after you like to cause too havoc. Kind. Yes, babe, you're just too nice for that. All right. So so this game has been like had like a lot of ups and downs, but we've just like quickly discovered that Andrew is a problem and we need to cut him loose. <laughs> Because we don't need that drama, okay? We don't need it. But let's have a, a look-see. Let's see what we can do. David, stop! Don't move! What? What's wrong? Can't you see? Right by your feet! An abyss! An abyss? What are you talking about? What? I'll guide you across. Just listen to my voice. One step back, then to your left. Please be careful. Okay. Stop. Okay. Turn to your right and move forward slowly. Please don't do that. It's hard to keep him straight. Stop. Turn to your right and move forward slowly. All right, that was a. Stop. <gasps> Turn to your left, then straight, but be careful. Okay. <gasps> Jesus, Crimeny, am I gonna die? That was too clear. Leah. What is happening? What just happened? Oh my gosh, my heart's beating. That scared me. Okay. Careful. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Thank God this is over. Yes, thank my... I really hope this is you, Father. Rory was right. We can only get through this together. <sighs> Jeez, I... I'm very scared that there's an abyss because you can't see it. So, also with the crappy camera angles. Careful. Jesus, Jesus. Come on. Careful, please. Ooh. Do we push buttons? Do we press the press? Ah, oh, Jesus. Just as well I can see it. Are we still in chapter 5 or is this chapter 6? Because I feel like. I guess, like, when you get to Andrea, it'd be chapter 6. Let me look. Let me. Look. No. Can we push it? Oh, damn it, it's not moving! Babe, who are you talking to? She's not here. Unless I've gone insane. Which, that's a viable option. Babe, if you don't get down. <laughs> so. Okay. So we got across the abyss, apparently. What the? Oh. Um. Oh, what's this? I can't reach the statue, but my reflection. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay, can we look at anything over here? Nope, no, go back. <laughs> Okay, so I'm guessing this is where we need to be because of the audio. He talked. Let's go back. Let's go back in. Let's go back in. Um, what? Okay. So I'm guessing leaving and going back in, that like turns the image, I guess. So let's try one more time. Let's try again. Let's go back in. Okay, we're- I did not hear a, pu a punch sound. Like, that scared me, because there was no sound or anything. Hmm... That's one. Okay... So we don't need to go back into that area. I didn't even look on this side. Okay. Alright, so... This game is really interesting. A lot of puzzles, though. A lot of puzzles I do not know how to solve Your by myself. Your tricks will not stop me. Jeez. Alright. What the? Okay. Your cheap tricks will not stop me. What the? Your cheap tricks will not stop me. Oh! You want me to use this, father. But what for? Just don't ask questions. Like, pick it up. The same symbols as in the village. Uh -huh. And the gate. Do they have like a specific Oh, there's another rune. Do we just follow the doors? Okay. What was that? Damn. I must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. Alright, let's try again. Alright, so Okay. Wait, does there does it have something to do with runes here? Why is this upside down? So we got a P. A stone plate full of ancient symbols. P X R. The foot. P. Um. Okay, X. R. Wow, that was weird. Damn. R? I must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. What? Damn. I must have taken no. a wrong turn somewhere. No. Shut up. Shut up. So we were going the right way. Okay, P. Through here. Then X. And then R. And then we're back in this room. And what's over here? The chicken legs. Ooh, so. Yes! I knew it! Okay, I was like, it has to do so something with the stone. So, we just followed that pattern. I didn't even- I thought it, the game was glitching when I went through the R door, and the R door, like, glitched us back to the other door, but it was just part of the game, I guess. Lucky us. I hope I'm not too late. It didn't take too long. Unless I hope I'm too late. We need to end the family bloodline here. Because y'all are- Ooh. Y'all are insane. Hmm. 
Interesting. You put my hand on my controller so I'm not caught in surprise. Oh gosh. How did he get her? I'm. I don't want to know. The man's psychotic. I. I just live the here. Mera. The what? Mera. It's a pool of. So he's still alive. It looks like. Ah, David. I'm delighted you could join us. I knew you'd find your way here. Did you? Let the others go, Andrew. This is a family matter. Amongst us true Gordons. Oh. I you are that was so the right, wrong my word. dear cousin. This is a family matter. David! David. What? David. <laughs> no. If you think your cheap tricks can stop me, you're greatly mistaken. Get a grip, David. Mr. David, why did you let me what die? the heck? What the heck? What do I push? You have disgraced this family. Ooh, I hope this is just button prompts, because I can do that. I don't want to... Ooh, ooh, wrong button. You're not seeing the bigger picture, David. This family, this clan, was once powerful enough to drive the Roman legions out of Scotland. We can have that power again. No, let's just let it die. A village of innocence in the process. I want that as much as you, Andrew. But do you really think you can control the thing Edward has become? You are always a disappointment to me. You are nothing <sighs> less than nothing. Oh, that's not nice. Oh. We do. I'm I'm like being so quiet. Don't. <gasps> oh, now we gotta kill him. Now we gotta kill him. I'll be needing your blood too, David. Mm. Um, I don't know what to pick. <laughs> we don't need Edward. Um, we can find a way to control the mirror. You and I, together. Oh. I don't care for your disrespect for my father, for one of the greatest Gordons who has ever lived. Okay. Okay. What do you need me to do to complete the ritual and bring Edward back? Not much. Just a few drops of your blood. Okay. No. Give me the knife. I'll do it myself. David, my dearest cousin, you really need to stop treating me like I'm bloody stupid! I never said you're stupid. My father. Could he be brought back too? Pure Gordon blood flows through my veins. Once my father is freed, there will be nothing we cannot do. Very well. Together then. David, don't! Shut your mouth, woman! Oh, don't talk to my girl like that. We're in 2022 now. This is not 1930. <laughs> oh! Ah! Ah! X, 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 X! Ah, son of a biscuit, dude. Oh, my girl. We love blondes. <gasps> Help her! Help her! Oh! Oh! Okay. I pressed the wrong button because I was trying to... Are we gonna have to run? My hands are so sweaty. Are you alright? Of course. Yes. Of course. David! Oh my gosh. I like how it's button prompts though. I get very nervous if I have to fight. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
David, swim. You are mine! Mine! Swim, David, swim. David, swim. David, swim. <sighs> She's like such a boss. <laughs> we, we don't deserve her, but let's get out of here. Andrew's gone. Let's just run. I think we should be leaving. Okay. I, I agree. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not much of a fan of staying in a black puddle of water called the Black Mirror. But let's get out of here. Please don't crap out of me. Oh, so we don't control the run. That's nice. So they should have destroyed that place. That place be like be like haunted. I enjoyed that part. It was pretty interesting. I could have sworn there were six chapters though. Oh, they're sending him off like a proper proper Viking or ritual. Or uh, whatever they did, Rest shooting in peace, Rory. Shooting the arrows at the bull. If such boats. a thing is possible. What do you? You doubt it? <laughs> All that happened here. I am a scientist. I never thought there was an afterlife or anything after. And now, I know there's not only life after death, but there's evil there. My father, Rory. They saved us. And I must believe they found their peace. It's up to us to find out. Aw, his dad's staying in the water. And hope that it lasts. Dude. Is that the end? Is there any any like epilogues or anything like that? Oh my gosh. We made it to the end. I really I don't I don't even know how to explain how good this game was, but I will have to say it was kind of infuriating. Because if, if you if I was playing this by myself, I probably would have like not tried to use the guides as much. But since I was playing with you guys watching, I didn't want to be sitting here forever on a stream, like I said in the last episodes, that that's how I was recording it. I didn't want to be sitting on a stream for like an hour or two hours and have like the stream crash. So that's why I use the guides. I do recommend this game. Like, experience it for yourself, but I would do it alone. I wouldn't do it while watching or by playing a game for the people, but this was such a good game. And it was not a lot of megabytes or not a lot of storage so i'm pretty happy with that but um yeah guys that's the end i hope you guys enjoyed and yeah i'll catch you in the next episode deuces